This is the Truro boot. The Truro is a lifestyle winter boot by Baffin, and it features a waterproof upper, and they come in two different colors, black and brown. What stood out to me when I first put on the Truros was how comfortable they were, from the very plush footbed to the felt collar up at the top here. Uh, these boots are a great choice if you want something that is somewhat fashionable, yet functional at the same time. As I said before, these boots are waterproof. And although it's mostly well below freezing since I've had these boots and have been testing them out, I do remember one night that I was out and I had to run over to the local Home Depot. And uh, the night before there was a huge uh, pileup of snow and uh, it, there was a big thaw as well that same, the, the next day. So there was about five inches of slush in the parking lot. And uh, I saw people with running shoes trying to hop from area to area that had little slush. And trust me, that evening it was fun watching them, but I was really happy I had these on my feet. So when I went out there, I deliberately plowed through every slush pile that was in my way and did the same thing on the way back out of the store to the car. And uh, I can tell you that the slush was over the top of the boots uh, and it was well up onto the tongue where it was, I mean, this stuff was really wet slush that night and there's puddles everywhere. And so I can say that this is definitely waterproof, um, but, and, and no water got through the area of the tongue either. So that was pretty surprising. I was really happy with that. But what I was curious about was to see how the leather upper would handle that and if it would stain. Now I can say that I just brought these right out of the box and I never sprayed them. I'm not sure if you're supposed to, but uh, I just like taking them out and seeing how well they hold up. And uh, yeah, after that night when they were soaked, when I brought them home, I was curious if there's going to be any discoloration and I'm happy to report there's been absolutely nothing. Now the discoloration that is on here is just from wear and tear and use and scratches and scrapes. Um, but there's nothing like a, a discoloration from watermarks on the leather whatsoever. Another awesome feature, which I don't usually comment on with shoes, is the heel loop to put these boots on. With a full size boot like this, you definitely want a good heel loop to be able to pull these boots on easier. Now this loop has a large opening. You can easily fit two fingers in there, one quickly if you really want. Uh, but when you put them in there, you can reef on this because this is very thick leather on the back here, as you can see, and you can reef on this to pull these boots on and you know, you can just tell that it's durable. So apply as much force as needed to get them on and uh, you'll definitely appreciate having that. Now, when it comes to grip, the Truro boot has an ice bite outsole. As the name implies, obviously the compound is slip resistant. Baffin reports it's uh, three times more slip resistant than conventional rubber. So from my subjective opinion and the wear over the last couple months, uh, I could easily notice that the ice bite compound stays really soft in these cold, cold winter temperatures. So that's great. Is it gonna stop you from slipping on black ice if you hit a patch? Probably not, but in those snowy, icy conditions where there's a little mix of both, I definitely noticed that the grip was superb on the Truro. So one thing to note, if you're looking at these boots online on the Baffin website, they look way bulkier in the pictures than they actually uh, are in real life. Uh, I would say they're not as traditional as a normal winter boot, but they're definitely not as slim as one of those fancy dress boots that people are wearing these days. Uh, but they're a nice combination of both. So they definitely have a, a, an ability to wear them with like thinner type jeans, but uh, they have the functionality of keeping your foot warm and uh, dry in the winter. Now, one thing on the Baffin website is they say that these boots run a little bit small. I always wear a size 11. I purchased a size 11 and I can say that the fit feels perfect for me. Now, these boots are definitely comfortable. Uh, they, I think they look great and I've been wearing them nonstop because of those two reasons. And on top of it all, they keep your feet warm and, and dry at the same time. So the, I think in uh, where I live, about an hour north of Toronto, these have been an amazing winter boot and they're kind of perfect for uh, our climate out here. So if you're looking for a boot that is gonna be, you know, an everyday type boot, a lifestyle type boot that if you wanna go off the pavement and into the trails for a little bit of a hike uh, in snow that's not too deep, I look no further than the Baffin Truro boot. Uh, this boot's been amazing to me. It's held up well so far, and I'm gonna continue to wear this because it, it's been one of my favorites so far this winter season.